Hey, it's Matt from Practice Perfect. Congratulations on making it to the end of our Client Portal series. In part five, we're gonna tie it all together by showing you how to process self-entered clients and their web appointments in Practice Perfect. Let's get started. Step one, when a client creates their own profile in the Client Portal, it enters into a special holding area in Practice Perfect. To access it, select Clients from the left-hand sidebar. There is a new client list called Unapproved Clients. This is a list of all the clients who registered themselves in the client portal. Double click one of the clients to open the client detail view. In their profile, you'll find an option called Patient Self Entered Approved. By checking this box, the patient becomes a part of your active clients list. Take notice of the notes along the top of the screen. Each of these will have the word web in front of it. This indicates that the patient has entered details such as their referral source, family physician, payer, guardian information, and more during registration in the client portal. This information will need to be entered in their profile manually in the appropriate sections. Why? It would be very hard to match up what the client had entered versus your actual physician and payer list due to potential spelling issues and various locations. Step two, there are two ways to go about letting patients schedule their own appointments online. These are discussed at length in part one. If the clinic has indicated that confirmation is required, then when a patient schedules their appointment online, it will be added to the scheduler. However, it will be marked as held. A reminder will pop up in Practice Perfect a few minutes after an appointment is scheduled in the client portal. The reminder notifies you that there are new appointments awaiting review. To review these appointments, click Actions and select Web Appointment Listing. Here you will see all of the appointments that were scheduled in the client portal. To confirm an appointment, simply flag it and choose Book Selected Appointments on the function bar. The patient will receive an automated email when the appointment is confirmed by you, notifying them that their request has been accepted. Please note that appointments booked in the client portal will be added to your schedule regardless of whether or not your settings require confirmation. However, there will be a held icon in the appointment cell indicating that it was booked in the client portal and that it still needs to be confirmed by a staff member. But if the clinic indicated that confirmation is not required, it will automatically be marked as pending when it's added to the scheduler and no further action is required. And that's it. That's how you use the client portal. If you need a hand with any of the steps discussed in the previous five videos, please feel free to contact the support department. Thanks for watching. We hope to see you again soon.